Hi, the topic for our presentation today is how effective leadership can facilitate change in organization through improvement and innovation. Our group member consists of four people which is Maverick McLean, Manisha Anisia, Rena Jawai, and Elsie Stacy. Hello guys, so the article that we chose for this article review is how effective leadership can facilitate change in the organizations through improvements and innovations by Professor Rasmat and Mo Jun Ho. In this article, it is emphasized on the importance of leadership and organizations and how leadership can be included in a change in the organizations. Hence, this article is also stated that the effective leadership will require managing change to create improvements and innovations in the organizations. According to the masterclass, leadership can be defined as the ability of persons or group to lead a team, organize and motivate members in the group towards their target goals. Hence, leadership is an act that guides persons to lead the projects and activities. Meanwhile, innovative leadership is a leadership style that involves using innovations and creative to manage the people and the project according to the career guide. Under the background issues, in this article of the case study, the author mentions that the rapid growth of the economy will require effective leadership that can influence change management. This is because the rapid growth of the economy requires modern market managing skills. Hence, I would agree with the author point of view. This is because the modern market managing skills are more advanced and require a lot of adjustments in the organizations today. The advanced technology news will cause a major change in the basics for the managerial functions, according to Williams. This will cause us the increase of the responsibility of the organizations to emphasize on planning, decision-making, coordinations of the organizations. Hence, the leadership plays a vital role in trying to adapt the managing change in the organizations by increasing the learning to provide the innovations towards the change in the organization's culture. Hello, I am Marisha. Now, I will present the change factor lead by leadership. According to this article, the author has stated that change management can help the organization catch the opportunity to gain a competitive advantage if the organization effectively and efficiently implement and adapt to the change in the market. I agree with the statement from the author about if there is no effective leadership in the organization, no change will be made because there is no leader that motivates and leads the organization. The author has shown us how important the role of the leader in the group of the employee make the strong relationship and build trust between employees. The author has write in this article about how trust can change the relationship between leader and employee. Trust can in leader is the one that lead the performance of the teamwork. If the employee trusts the leader, this relationship will bind them together and improve the performance and commitment of the employee. Then leadership also is the key of good organizational culture. A good culture was shaped by trust. Trust brings harmony and positive vibe to organizational culture. As we know, a positive organizational culture not only improves performance, but it also influences the attitude of the employee in the organization to be better. Other than that, the author also stated that an effective leader can encourage the employee to learn and give motivation. The leader also should open their mind to learn from other people to strengthen their skill and knowledge. Next, the author also stated that leader must have teamwork and communication skill to create a positive environment and culture with employees. Leader must encourage the worker to have communication with each other. As we know, that communication can help people to know each other and that also can help us to create more ideas by sharing our opinion with other people. The author also briefly said that leadership is not only influence the employee but also the one that show the right path of direction for the employee to be better. That's all from me. Thank you. Hi, I'm Elsie. Now I will move to the second content which is effective leadership. Effective leadership 
leadership is an essential criterion in handling management. Leadership and management are two different things. Management is the way where the owner of the business, for example, the owner will control everything in the organization. Meanwhile, leadership is where the leader works together with the co-workers to complete their goals. It is a response where the leader can influence and change the value of their co-workers. Thus, effective leadership can help smooth the way for change in the organization. This article supports that the leader can make a change for the organization through improvement and innovation. As a leader, the way they handle the organization must be changed according to the current trends. It is to make the change more effective in the organization. Other than that, a leader is supposed to guide their co-workers. Effective leadership will never leave their co-workers behind without knowing anything regarding their job in the organization. Compared to the old style of management, where the leader or the upper management will only give direction to a co-worker. Leaders are the ones that provide mission and vision to the organization. Therefore, as a leader, they need to be clear with the mission and vision. Then, with a clear direction, the organization will be performed well. Hence, leadership is a factor that needed in an organization because it will bring changes in the organization. Hi, my name is Yana Jawai and I will conclude the topic that my group has discussed earlier. In conclusion, effective leadership playing an important role in managing the company. According to this article, the leader play an essential part in finding an effective way to achieve the organization goal and also in finding a solution to the problem that arise during the process. This will require the leader in the company need to change the old way of business management to the new management based on the current business environment now today. This will make them able to improve their skill and always adapt to the new trend in managing the company. It is because in the new management environment, leader will directly involve in guiding and motivating the employee on how to achieve the organization vision and mission. Based on the information that has been provided in this article, this article is a good reference for the leader that wanted to improve their skill and also for the people that will become a leader in future. Thank you.